Google, YouTube, it's Gord. Today we're going to talk about something that affects me a lot. Migraines, headaches. Very, very painful headaches. Migraines are probably the worst thing that a person can suffer. It, it can it can affect the whole body. Um, I live in Calgary, which is like Denver, Colorado, a mile high city. Uh, we're at the base of the Rocky Mountains and we are tied with Denver for the most migraines per capita. I only have one migraine in my whole life, in my whole adult life, living 22 years in Edmonton, north of here. I moved here 15 years ago and I, it's been migraine city ever since. Now, but I want to talk about headaches, but I want to talk about them as in regards to medicating properly and what the restrictions that the judge and my ex-wife have placed on me and what they, what they mean to me looking after myself. My son's here today. Now, truly with the migraine, uh, this is, I've spoken to so many people. I could not find the right migraine medicine. I was on um, Topamax daily, every single day, 100 milligrams, every single day for the last five years, trying to, four years, trying to cut down. Um, and for severe headaches, they would give me this. While I was on antidepressants as well, and I've looked up some things about this, but Axert, which is an elmotriptan, um, for severe headaches. Now, I want to give you a really good example because today, while my son's here, I have developed a migraine. We're about to go through a weather change, and I have developed a migraine. I have only a few choices when it comes to trying to live with this. A severe migraine, it's almost impossible to really look after your child. Many of us do it, but it becomes almost impossible. You're dizzy, you're sick to the stomach, lots of things. So I have a choice. I could take one of these. These put you to sleep. You'll, and they suggest anyway, even if they don't, you need two hours of sleep right after taking it for it to properly affect the brain and eat away at the migraine. They have worked. Sometimes they have not, but they have worked. That means telling my son to be alone? No. Nope. So I can't do that. Can't do that. Then there's these really super extra strength Advils. I could take a couple of those and just live with the pain. It certainly cuts down on the problems. It increases the stomach pain. And that is an alternative that I can do. My care for my child will be affected. But I'll be able to care for him. So so far out of these two, that one, gone. But Advil has, first, the excerpt side effects are absolutely incredible. The side effects, I want to talk about that before. The, the one I threw away, the, another reason for throwing it away. These are just the more advertised ones. There is a link for the full list, which I wouldn't read to you. It's huge. But feeling of pain or tightness in your jaw, neck, or throat. Chest pain or heavy feeling. Spread, pain spreading to the arm or shoulder. Generally ill feeling. Sudden numbness or weakness, especially on one side of the body. Sudden severe headache. Sudden severe headache from something that's supposed to get rid of the headache. Uh, confusion, problems with vision, speech, or balance. Sudden and severe stomach pain. And I've had that before from this and bloody diarrhea, numbness or tingling, and the pain 
or blue colored appearance in fingers and toes. And if you're taking an antidepressant, which I was, I'm not anymore, agitation, hallucinations, fever, fast heart rate, overactive reflexes, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, loss of coordination, and fainting. Wow. Just to try and get rid of a migraine. So we all know Advil, minor side effects. No. Not real good for the internal organs. Taking a couple of these do not get rid of the headache. They just numb the effects and they numb you. So that's still a choice. But I want to tell you, concentrated cannabis in the shatter or wax format, really high THC levels. All I need, one or two shots of this, my migraine's gone. Usually won't come back. Sometimes I might need to take another one in a couple hours. But the migraine would be gone, gone. Now, if the child wasn't here, that's gone too. Because it makes sense. There are no side effects except for being happy and over your pain. Um, there, there really is no numbing. It opens everything up and it solves migraines. It has, I've tried so many things for so many years and this gets rid of a migraine. And I can totally look after a child after taking one of these, but because of the restrictions that that's stupid judge and my ex-wife put on me. I'm not allowed to do this until tomorrow night when he goes home. I can only take the top, the Advil and I won't because I have severe stomach pain already. I don't need more. So I'm just going to deal with this and Pasha will have his care affected because I can't move around a lot. I can't do a lot. We're not going to do anything. It's absolutely ridiculous when the best medicine is out of reach while it's in my hand. Peace.